Hey YouTube, just a quick video really, just an update on something that I found on my sort of research for my IT products. I've come across this thing, uh, it's like a, a plugin, it's the word, a plugin for Firefox, it's called Firesheep. I uh, don't know if you've heard of it, it's basically an easy way to hack people's social networking sites, or basically anything with a login, and it uses cookies from the, the logins on the unsecured website. So say if you went to a coffee shop or an airport, somewhere that you want to log into your Wi-Fi, it will use the cookies to sort of mold them together and just be an easy way for people to log into your account, change your passwords, change your information, do that all kind of stuff. Uh, people are malicious like that. So I'm going to post links in the bottom to links of all stuff about how to install it. So I'm just basically going to run through quickly. What you do is you go to the links and there will be this link to, it will be the third option and it will say you have to install this WinCap app thing. I don't know how you pronounce it but it's, it's there. You install that, download it, install, it will run, it's a little program, I don't even know what it does. But it works, you install that, then you download the little plugin for Firefox, you install that, you run it with Firefox, it comes up, plug in, install, run through the options. Once it's installed, press Ctrl Shift S, a little file sheet box will come up, and once that comes up, it will should say uh, start capturing. You click on that and it will say and then the start will turn to stop. That means you're currently capturing cookies. So then go to another browser or another laptop if you have one and log in to Facebook, Twitter, anything like that that needs to log in. Then it should come up with on the side, it should come up with your Twitter username, Facebook username, or whatever you've logged into. Then you know you've you've done it correctly. You double click on it, then it will come up within the, that person's account that you're using and then that's it you've hooked you've hacked it you don't need passwords you don't need anything it's just it's really crazy that someone's created something so simple so easy to be able to hack into other people's accounts it's it's pure madness uh, and that's it it should work I personally have tried it and it hasn't worked for me I have no idea why it says I need an Ethernet thing or something when my, I'm using Wi-Fi I don't know why it doesn't make sense but it's mainly for Mac users at the moment, so if you're a Mac user, you're in for the money, you can use it. At the moment, it's sort of baited, beta, 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 whatever you want to say that. Word, it's pretty much that for Windows at the moment. But they mostly will release some sort of information on how to use it for Windows. And if you're running Linux, then, well, it's not supported for it yet, but it will come out soon enough, because Linux is a major operating system. It's going to be a bit harder because you've got so many operating systems for Linux. People mainly um, show how to use it, but they don't say how to protect yourself from it. And I've been looking into it, and the main way, or the easiest way, to protect yourself from a place um, is basically not to use open Wi Fi. But if you have to use open Wi Fi, in the URL you'll see http dot dot slash slash. If you put HTTPS, S meaning secure, safe, it will protect your cookies. And in the little URL bar, it should come up with a padlock. And that means that you are secure and that you are logging in and everything's safe. And no one can access your account, which is the easiest way to do it. And that's pretty much it. This is scary technology that people uh, are using. So if you go to a... a a Wi-Fi place that's unsecure, you know, perform safe browser sex because if you don't then you'll become hacked and you can end up with all sorts of problems. If you like my video, please like it. If you like me even more, subscribe, it really make me happy. Leave me comments if you don't understand anything, if you've got problems, I will try to answer them to the best of my ability. I don't personally understand everything that's going on at the moment, but I'll try my best. You know, I'll try and do a bit of research for you. But that's all, really. Uh, hope you've enjoyed the video. Hope it's been informational for you. Hope you've learnt something. Don't forget, protect yourself with the S. The S for safe.
proud of sex. Um, I'll catch you soon. Peace.